Welcome to our series, What's This? How Do I Kill It? Where we cover how to efficiently take down the most challenging enemies in the game. Today, we're covering Overload Champions. Overload Champions are the most annoying type of champion in Destiny. They're able to quickly regenerate health while doing massive damage to anyone trying to bring them down. They have a circle symbol next to their health bar by the smug looks on their stupid faces. To take down these champs, you're going to need to equip an overload mod on your arms here. Next, slot a weapon that matches the type shown on the mod. Now you're ready to go hunting. When you engage an overload, it will attempt to teleport away and re-engage from another angle. Tracking their movement is key to bringing them down fast. When you aim down sights, your HUD will display that you have overload rounds. Lay into it with your anti-champ weapon. This will stun the champion. When an overload is stunned, it will stop attacking you and it will be incapable of regenerating health, allowing you to burst it down with your heavy, special, and or grenades. If you're able to do enough damage, it's GG's on the champ. And do an emo on their dead body. Dude. No. If you aren't able to fully stick it to the champ, it will begin to glow. While glowing, it cannot be restunned and will actively attempt to reposition. Do not stop shooting it with overload rounds. Doing this prevents it from healing. After a few seconds, the glow will fade and you can restun the champion. Do big damage while it's stunned. And then, emo on its dead body. Dude, why? What is up with you wanting to emo on its body? I hate overloads. I need to emo on their dead bodies. Just, just keep it professional, man. Fine. There are three exotic weapons in Destiny that have intrinsic overload. Number one is Divinity, an arc energy trace rifle. Perk on this weapon is Judgment. Sustained damage with this weapon envelops the target in a field that weakens and stuns them. Divinity is, hands down, the most useful weapon in higher level content, since in addition to the stun, it provides a 30% weaken to the champion or target. But you can easily rip through most enemies in the game with one of these in a fire team. Now this is available via an exotic quest from the Shadowkeep DLC. However, it will require you to do some puzzles and to complete the raid, the Garden of Salvation. Number two, Luminarch. A void energy bow with the perk Poison Arrows. Arrows fire quickly after a full draw become Poison Arrows. Precision hits with Poison Arrows spread poison to nearby enemies. Luminarch is the fantastically lethal answer to the problem of Overload Champions. While the stun to Overloads only applies to Poison Arrows, the spreading poison kills nearby red bars and poison tick damage prevents the overload from healing during its immunity phase. And if you use this in PvP, I hate you. You can get this at the Monument to Lost Lights. Number three, we have Thunderlord. This is the arc heavy machine gun with the perk Rain Havoc. Kills with this weapon generate lightning strikes from above. Thunderlord, it's just fun. It's like Thor said to Odin, you know what I wanted to wield today? A machine gun. And Odin was like, okay, how about this one? When the Rain Havoc is enabled, you'll watch enemies getting roasted in hordes and stragglers fleeing for their lives. All in all, this weapon is a 10 out of 10 for pure destruction. And this is just a world drop exotic. That's everything you need to know to kill Overload Champions in Destiny 2. If you want to learn how to kill Barrier and Unstoppable Champions, check out our other videos linked in the description below.